<laughs> All of you guys out there in Oregon are missing out. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? What are we gonna give that a seven? We'll give that a seven. A ten? All right. All right. We went from swimming to fishing. Let's see. Let's see. Tom Pedro's gonna hook us up. Don't stop reeling. Let him know when you see color, son. You're left-handed, so that's why we have to hard time with this. Do that right now. Auntie Flo doesn't want to reel. She has her younger brother reeling. Oh wow, Mafuti, nice. Beautiful, good. You know that's good fish to fry, right? Come on, Auntie. Don't worry, Auntie Flo. It's fine. Don't worry. It's all up from here. Get it, girl. This is for your grandkids at home watching the film. Back when I Ooh, back I see it. I see little color. More. Just a little more. I see color. Okay. Walk back. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> awesome. Oh, I'm so tired. Where's the chair? <laughs> oh, the rod. I got the rod. I got the rod. You got the rod? Yes, ma'am. Beautiful day. Neutral. Hooked up, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, 
Oh, wow. Look at that. Check it out, Dr. Joe. Woo! Keep this. This is a giant tumbler. Let's go. All right, and the flow hooked up again. Let's get it. Let's go show those grandkids back home watching you, okay? Yeah, come on. You know how to do this. You're an island girl. Come on. There you go. You have to roll faster, though, okay? Because I don't want to lose it. I'll put your glasses on your head, okay? Hey! Keep it, keep it, keep it. fish we're gutting it we're breaking it down we're gonna cook it for to flow right here on the dock guys all right now we're gonna salt and pepper our fish we're keeping it natural guys okay this is as fresh as you're gonna get it Straight from the ocean to this table. So this is going to be my first time winning a trumpet fish. It'll be kind of interesting. Good, good, good. Salted, pepper, yeah. Okay. Now we're ready to get to the fryer, right? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yes. All right. There goes nothing, guys. 
wet, so I'm probably gonna get hot. First time ever playing or not playing, but you know, processing a trumpet. I don't even know. Can I get meat out of this? I think I'm gonna get meat out of this. I don't know what's that in the middle, but I get meat out of it. Believe me, we are going to get meat. Ooh. Nice. Oh, my God, she was used to that. Wow. One side down. Those are Don Pedro's pets. Right? Yeah, they're here because he's feeding them right now. Taking pictures of it. Oh my goodness. Here, you can even use this finadeni if you want. Just put the finadeni on. Oh my god, look at that tail. There you go. That looks amazing. Ooh! Yeah, try it. Did I make it crispy enough? I was worried. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Mm. I'm gonna do this. There's gonna be some bones, so just be careful, yeah. okay? All right, to Flo, oh eating her cat, fresh oh off the boat, oh right on the dock. Oh yep, there you go. Mm -hmm. How is it? Oh my God. Mm. Good? Yep. Mm -mm -mm. Awesome. Try it out, Don Pedro. Mm. You want to get in there? Those kids missed out. Yep. Oh my god, it's so good. Mmm. <laughs> Just eat a towel. Oh my god, it's so yummy. Mm. Here, you guys, it's been a demi. We're so used to Just eating it plain and raw. Mmm. I have to get meat off of this. Okay, so check it out. There's a like a hard spine on the middle, so I'm getting it down there and just trying to slice off the, the skin. Very little meat, but it looks like good meat. It looks like white meat, like waffle. Mm -hmm. Just leave it, that would be good. Okay. Oh, okay. We all know what it is. <laughs> go ahead, go back. Go back. So you got this whole thing right here? Yeah. No meat. You want to put some, uh, yeah, right? Just pull it up and, oh, gosh. All right, there's that trumpet fish, guys. My first time color it. it. Mm. How is yeah. it? Yeah. Right, let me try a little bit more just so I can really know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's good? It's How's good. the lemon? Good? Yeah, the lemon's good because it's calamansi. It's good? All right? Yeah. The bunny's good? Mm -hmm. All right. Let's blow here. That's that trumpet fish, that, that long nose fish that we call it? Mm -hmm. There it is. Fresh telegram on the dock. Oh and I use calamansi, local calamansi, oh so try it. Hey, you should see me with the calamansi. I'm like, I want calamansi, everything, mm. lemonade, mm. you name it. And you can get in the, the wasabi, don't be scared. Mm -hmm. How is it? Chris, get story. Good? Delicious. <laughs> There, now you're having fresh fish caliguin. Oh my god. The caliguin, the it's fresh so fish that you yummy. caught. That was that long, long yeah. one we got? Yeah, that was the that trumpet was fish. fish. That was that. Back at the shop now, Fancy Flow. All right, this is the next day. We just had the catch and cook dinner on the dock last night. 
Now we're back in the shop to get some. Because look, she's getting some merch, guys. And I have to say, I need to give Don Pedro a tip. I have never, ever seen a kid like this who's 10 years old. I am totally and completely in love with this boy. Smart. Smart, hardworking, and a pescador from Guam. Here, this is for you, my boy. Thank you, thank you. I absolutely you think you're amazing. Thank you so you much. You don't have to hug me right now, but when you grow up, you better hug me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. All right, awesome. Drink. So, Auntie Flo, mm. um, this is for you too. I got to get you to let everyone in the world watch and know how your experience was. You're from Guam, but you haven't been on Guam for, what, 20 years? Yeah, something so like that? how do you want me to do that? I put it all on Facebook, but I don't know how. <laughs> no! Oh, Did oh, you really? Oh, she was interviewing you or not. <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah, we just want to let the world know how it was. I mean, coming from, from Oregon and not being on Guam for t over 20 years and experience an ocean adventure like this, let the people of the world watching know what they're missing out on. Okay, first of all, I need to say that I'm a proud Chamorro, even though I've lived in Oregon for actually over 40 years. 40 years. Wow. And my experience yesterday was bar none an experience of a lifetime. Not only was the scenery spectacular, the water so blue, but that boat ride was invigorating. And I tell you, I am almost 70 years old and I had a blast. I, I snorkeled, I caught fish, I, we fried fish, we made telequin. Where in the world do you go to go do all those things on, in one day? And we saw the most beautiful sunsets. I mean, these guys hands down are the best at what they do. And I'm totally, completely in love with their son. Yep, <laughs> so check them out. They're worth every penny. Awesome. Thank you so no, much. Thank you. So but it was really our pleasure to Yeah. Oh my God. I can't even tell you. Um, I'm telling everybody, Mike, so I had a good time. <laughs> well, see, since I met you in Uncle Tony's office, uh -huh. I, that's what I said. Okay, the pressure's on. Oh. Some, some people hold under pressure and some embrace it. And I love it because your oh. the enthusiasm and your spirit, I knew that it was gonna be great no I'm matter what you. On, on the ocean. I'm glad we got to make and that happen. you are spectacular at, at what you do as a captain of the Thank ship, you. but also making it really fun for those of us that would have never thought we could even catch a fish. I know.